All right. Uh, welcome to our uh, afternoon session. Uh, our first talk here is uh, going to be by uh, Dimitru from uh, Red Hat. He's going to talk to us about IP multicast and OVN, uh, IGMP snooping and relay. Hi, everyone. Um, so yeah, I'm going to talk about IP multicast in OVN. Oh. Yeah. First of all, um, I'm going to show you a, a use case of OVN. This is actually a simplified, oversimplified uh, OVN Kubernetes topology, where we have uh, one node per logical switch. And uh, what's important here is that VMs that are on different nodes, they might be in the same network namespace. It's called in um, in Kubernetes. And they, they need to be able to communicate to each other with either unicast but also multicast. So right now, if, um, for example, VM2 wishes to receive, to receive multicast, it will send an IGMP join, which will just be flooded in the broadcast domain of the logical switch. And it will be dropped by the logical uh, router, cluster lo logical router. And then if VM5 is the source of uh, IP multicast traffic for that group, again, it sends traffic, but it gets loaded only in its, in its own uh, broadcast domain. What happens in a, in a traditional networking use case? So if you, know, if you notice here, the switches are out of the, of the nodes, assuming they're physical switches. If we enable IGMP snooping, and IGMP relay and querier and uh, multicast routing on the on the cluster router, then switch one will learn the IGMP the IP multicast group from the IGMP report, and then when traffic arrives, it's nicely loaded to the VM that's interested in the traffic. So it's optimal 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 forwarding. Okay, um, let's zoom in a bit in in um, in one of the nodes in OVN. So again, assuming that we don't enable IGMP snooping, whenever there's multicast traffic that's uh, sent by, by, one, by one of the VMs, this one will match a logical flow that uh, sets as output port a multicast group called MC flood, which basically translates to a sequence of OVS flows that sets the, um, the logical output port and then run the egress pipelines. And this is done sequentially, and there are a few issues. First, we float to all the switch ports, even though they're not interested in the traffic, potentially. And um, the fact that we run the pipeline sequentially means that we perform a lot of resubmit. And there's a 4K resubmit limit in OVS. Now, if we enable IGMP snooping in OVN, uh, what happens when uh, VM1 sends a report saying that it's interested in multicast traffic for a specific group? OVN controller, so the packet will get pointed to OVN controller, which installs an entry in the IGMP groups table in the southbound database. And OVN NORSD monitors that table and then creates more specific flows matching the multicast traffic and uh, a multicast group consisting of the ports where the traffic should go. And then when traffic arrives from a different VM, instead of being flooded to all the logical flows, to, to all the logical ports, it gets um, efficiently forwarded only to the port that's interested in the traffic. So it's, it's really similar to the traditional snooping. Now the, the interesting part is when we route, in OVN, that translates in, into enabling a relay on the logical router, so multicast relay. And whenever the, um, the IP multicast group is learned by, uh, on logical switch one, because in OVN we have an, a view of the whole network, we can actually install logical flows on both the data path of logical switch one and the logical router. So then instead of uh, having a packet being processed twice, like in the traditional, traditional scenario, we now process it once on OVN controller on node one, update the southbound database, and NordD will, ta will take care of installing the flows that need to forward the traffic. And then when traffic um, arrives from VM5, it's going to get forwarded to the logical router pipeline, 
there it matches the logical flow installed for the log for, for the IP multicast group on the router data path, gets forwarded to logical switch one and efficiently forwarded only to the VM that's interested in the traffic. Currently, IGMP snooping and querier are available in OVN 2.12. IGMP relay is available in OVN master along, along with uh, static multicast configuration. It allows you to define per port slot configuration for also for IP multicast traffic, but also for reports. So this would allow connecting OVN to upstream multicast routers that could, for example, run PIM or other routing protocols. This is also available in OVN master. There are a few concerns. There is some additional load in OVN controller and OVN NORD because we need to process the, new, the packets and we need to install entries in Southbound database, them in NORD. Uh, the 4K resubmit limit is still a potential issue. It's harder to reach now for multicast traffic, but it's still possible if many hosts join the same multicast group. And uh, the last thing is that IPv6, IPv6 is not supported yet. So MLD still needs to be implemented. That's it. Thanks. All right, if we have uh, one quick question, uh, we can take it. It doesn't look like it. Uh, let's thank our speaker again.